to Miami, Florida. This is what the port looks like sailing from Miami. But I can't wait to show you. We got a great tour today of the Carnival Horizon because we're heading out down in the Southern Caribbean. Make sure you're watching all those videos. But for now, let's just get right into this tour of the Carnival Horizon. There's Miami back in the background. And here in the horizon, they got two hot tubs and a pool in the back. And there's the outside bar. All right, there's a close up of that pool. But you turn around, this is the outdoor bar. This is where everybody hangs out before the sail away. And there's a pizza bar. He's making them right here, fresh. It's on the back of this ship. And next to that pool is one of the hot tubs. Let me tell you, nobody's in this yet because it's hot out right now and nobody's gotten to their room to get their bathing suits. I sneak up on my wife because we're getting ready for the sail away. All right, this is one of the main pools deck. Here's also, you got the red frog bar and the tequila bar back there in the corner. And up there are the water slides. There's an overhead shot of that pool, but do you see behind it? That's where you get to watch movies on that big screen. You come up here and you get one of these chairs along here and you can watch a movie. There's the water park. Look at these nice chairs. There's the water works park. This is where all the kids are hanging today. Dr. Seuss's water works. Kids, am I seeing this right? Is that the Grinch enjoying the hot summer day in Miami? There's where you grab your tubes to go up this thing. We're right in the middle of this right now. Here comes that bucket. Boom! Check this out. It looks like a car wash. Oh, I'm having fun in this water park. You know I am. Help! That's how you get wet. And parents, this is where you hang out. And this Serenity Lounge, I think I said it on one of my other videos. I think this place is spectacular because I like all the plants they got around, all the clamshells. It's just beautiful way to spend the day. When you got a sea day, come up here. And they got the cushion lounge chairs here on the horizon, complete with its own bar. It ain't a quite yet. I was one of the first on this ship today. Interior room on the horizon. Very simple. TV, bathroom, lots of wood, shower. All you need on a cruise ship. It is time to get this sail away going on the Carnival Horizon. We're leaving out of Miami port. You can see the icon of the seas there. There's an MSC, I think it's the Seascape. Let's get moving and get on with this tour and see ya. That is the largest cruise ship in the world for now. I think there's a bigger one coming. But let me tell you one thing, this thing is beautiful. It is massive. It is the icon of the seas by Royal Caribbean. And here we go. Leaving port, there's Miami Beach. Heading out to sea. Good. And they even got fresh seafood like this. Lobster, crab legs, fresh fish you name it seafood related all right this is the lido marketplace this is on deck 10. if you don't want to go to the dining room or for breakfast lunch or dinner you can come in here they serve breakfast lunch and dinner in the marketplace they got drink stations but one thing i love is 
the decor in here. You got the trees. You'll see some umbrellas up in here. This is part of the buffet. They're getting ready to serve dinner. It's not quite time. I think it's only like 4.30. But this is where you'll get all your food when you're ready. Assortment of fruits and there's some desserts. Naval orange cake. I have one thing about Carnival. I do think they have a great salad bar. Fresh stuff. Oh, and they got roast pork sliced to order. The buffet lines, you can walk the whole way around. No obstruction. Looks like there's four different areas. They all serve the same food that we've seen, but still check it out. You don't know what you're going to find. All right, and this is something you can't miss on any Carnival cruise ship. The free liquor tasting. There's one of mine, the Shipwreck Coconut, and that is Sheridan. Those things are amazing. Now, on deck four is the Limelight Lounge. This is where they got the comedian's location. When you, when you drop something, you like, uh, <laughs> do I really need that $20 bill? I don't know. I got money. I don't need it. <laughs> I'm on an eight-day cruise. I'm rich. And the elevator stations are fantastic, too, as you'll see. Make sure you're using these properly. Now, one thing that's unique about this ship, and you got to get used to it, is the elevators. So in case you have problems using the elevator, they got instructions. You select your deck, read your elevator car assignment, and get in. Car C. And it'll tell you which car to go to. Again, something to get used to. It's supposed to speed things up. There's no buttons. Once you hit that button outside, that's where you're going. So don't hop on with somebody else because you're going where they're going. Now, one thing that I think that's new when the last time I was on here, I don't remember these like 3D pictures. They got all over this ship. They're just beautiful. And like any cruise ship or a carnival, they always have art galleries, art shows. Here's some of the stuff you can bid on. Oh, and they got a sports bar. This is the Skybox Lounge. Check this out. I bet you wonder why nobody's in here. It's four o'clock in the morning. Somehow I got up and thought it was seven, but this is neat. Looks like a Texas Hold'em table right inside the bar. Uh, and this is the casino inside. There's your table games over there. You got some slots over here. There's people gambling at four in the morning. That's on deck four too. Plenty of slot machines to play around on. And this is what the Horizon is known for. One of these funnels. I just love this thing because it's constantly changing. I'll show you different scenes here. Don't worry about that. But look, do you see how it goes up in the ceiling? So here's one of the restaurants you get to eat in. If you're eating in the dining room, they're complimentary. They're probably getting set up for breakfast, it looks like. Any problems you have, you want to come here. This is guest services. I love these tables here at the Blue Iguana. I just think they're unique. I don't remember seeing these last time. I think there was something else here. And if you want to watch a movie, what a perfect spot. And make sure you're always coming up to the top decks at night. You talk about a view. These chairs are perfect. I don't know if you can see them lights in the distance, but that we're sailing past Cuba. Here's the deli order food, hot and cold sandwiches. When you're in the back part of the buffet, one thing I want to show you, because it is a secret of mine. There's a pay restaurant. It's called Cusiana del Capitano. Find this, you'll see stairs. It's the only entrance I know of to get up here. But this is where they serve Italian food. And make sure you watch my secrets video because there's something special about this place. Ah, and this is cool. This must be where the captain sits. And for all your excursions, Carnival's got the adventure desk to book excursions. But for those adventurous, make sure you're watching my Viator video. I'll show you what we do. We don't come here. And this one, 
has a piece of my heart because we were here. That is old San Juan. Make sure you're watching our video because we almost got killed here. And don't worry, yes, this is a big ship, but these are at every elevator to show you you are here and where you wanna go. Here we are at the warehouse and circle C. What is that all about? Well, let me tell you, it is for the kids. If you have kids, you make sure they come here on the first day because they have all kinds of activities. Here's the arcade they have, it's called the warehouse. It's a very big arcade, all kinds of games. Looks like it's got two sides. I don't know, it just keeps going on and on here. Jurassic Park, Reloaded, Halo. Oh, this is where you're, you win tickets. But Circle C is where you bring your kids to play all day. And on down on deck six is where the IMAX theater is. They got all kinds of shows, full length movies you can watch in IMAX. You can see there they got Venom, they got Last Glacier, some planet show, Deep Sky in IMAX. And where's all my people that want to be pampered all week? They got a Cloud Nine spa here, recharging station at the spa disconnect from the world and plug yourself in here. I love that motto. And make sure when you're getting on board, you download that Carnival Hub app because it's gonna show you how to get around. Here's your activities for the day and you can switch each day. You can heart them and it'll pop up and give you notifications when something is ready. I love this Carnival Hub app. There's shore excursions and different things to do. Here's spa. I think you can reserve spa in here in the salon. Great tool on any cruise ship. They pretty much have it. Oh, there's the ship maps, the hub app. You have this wall of moments. You can actually see what your fellow cruise passengers are doing. All right, here's the tube. We're going up to the top of this thing. Looks like you gotta be 42 inches tall. You got two slides. You got the one that's enclosed. And then you got the one that's got the tube. All right, here's the tube that you start in. And even if you're not going down the slide, make this climb because it's one of the best views on this ship. All right, and they do have miniature golf on this. They got a challenging. Look at all these little bumps you got to go through. All right, check out this ping pong table. I've never seen anything like this. It's a four-way. Ah! Oh. <laughs> Pull on the sportsplex decks. Oh, they got exercise equipment up here. My wife is pressing her own weight. <laughs> exercise equipment all around this deck from corner to corner. But do you see this view? All right, and if you're a beer drinker, this, they got in the marketplace. It's the only place they have it, but you can see you pay as you go, 50 cents per ounce. And the way I understand, that's a lot cheaper than if you go buy a beer in one of the bars. All right, and this is the theater. This is the liquid lounge. This is where you want to come for all your shows. Don't miss it. <laughs> got gift stores all along here. Make sure you're stopping in each one. This place goes on. They even got a Victoria's Secret in there. Oh yes, this is on this ship. And this is an Effie jewelry store. Where do you see how big this place is? I'm looking for the clearance section. If you like watches there on this ship. And this is the atrium bar here. It's just a beautiful setup they got. You want that? Yeah. <laughs> I like that part. Yeah, cool. All 
All right, guys, they got an Invictus store in here. Watches at sea. And the bar is gonna be open. Taste me tonight. All right, and this is the liquor store. They got tastings every single night, he said. But look at all this stuff they got in here. Tonight is Hennessy night. If you're into that, here's where we're going next. Cherry on top. All right, this is inside Cherry on top. Walk in this place because you can make your own ice cream sandwiches. But over here, if you've got a sweet tooth, this is where the candy is. You can fill up a tin here for relatively cheap. All right, we're filling the tin here. Best deal on the cruise ship. Let's see. Oh, I got these last time. Chocolate crisp. All right, guess they got hibachi in this place. Fried rice making it here right now. All right, and all the pictures you get done on this cruise ship is right here at Pixels. I think these engravings are incredible. And yes, you can get them done right here. And all you beer drinkers, look at this. They make all their beer right here. And you can actually take a tour inside of this thing. All right, this is the Java Blue Donut Bakery. But look at these donuts. But what thing that's got my attention has got to be these cookies. And they got a sushi a la carte here. You can go in and sit down and order. Or they got a sushi bar right back there. All right, this is the anytime dining room here. Look how beautiful it is. They got a bar. I don't know if I've ever seen a bar inside one of the restaurants, but that is just unique. I beg you, beg you, hon. I just don't think they understand. And if you tell my heart, my egg and baby, hon. All right, this is the first. We're trying the anytime dining. Look at this dining room. It is beautiful inside. All right, make sure you're coming to the dining room because you get food like this. That's filet mignano with short ribs. And my wife got a jumbo shrimp. All your bags are packed. You're ready to go. We're standing here in front of you. We hate to see you go and say goodbye. This is going to be a gorilla. I don't know if I see the gorilla. We've seen the monkeys hanging. The same in the, the body. Almost the body is the same. Okay. Yeah, right. This is the head part. And we put in the middle. The same. Okay. Oh, look at that. Hi. Now they can see you now. <laughs> there we go. We got <laughs> the rabbit, a gorilla, and oh, yeah, back there's the frog. The, frog. Ah. the piano oh. bar. It's open. Your turn. Sing us a song, you get a man. This is the sky ride. All right, here they come back up the other side. And let me tell you, this thing hangs over the edge of the ship. It ain't for the faint of hearted, I guess is that what they call it. Look who showed up on the Lido deck this morning. Grabbing their chairs early for this one. See all the towel animals? And we're just sailing into Jamaica here for the day. All right, my wife is going to do the rope course. Here she goes. She's a professional. Oh, she's got number one down. All right, I think she's scared on this one. Make sure you're liking and subscribing because she's doing this totally without a net and for the channel. Oh God. There goes the sky ride. It looked like it went right underneath of her. She's... <laughs> she's... <laughs> she's stuck. <laughs> She's on the second part 
Oh, she's breezing through now. She's got this. I'm proud of her today because she is scared to death. I thought she'd quit, but she keeps going. I will guarantee you one thing. I'm so much in trouble when she gets off of this thing for talking her into this. Oh, watch her hug the pole. <laughs> How was that? I need a drink. <laughs> And don't miss the ice carving on the Lido deck on the Carnival Horizon. Not sure what he's making, but it's still fun and cool to see. Looking good, man. Looking good. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Look at his toppings here. All right, beside the Capitana is Gigi's Asian Kitchen. And the nice thing about the Asian kitchen, again, it's free at lunchtime. Made to order. How you doing? And then you can come down from either one of the Italian or the Asian for dessert. Look at all these incredible desserts they got today. And this is on every carnival ship, I think. The Blue Iguana Tequila Bar. Tell me this don't look inviting. Get your feet in the water by this pool. The Blue Iguana Cantina, but look, they actually make their own tortilla shells right here. He's putting it in the top and it's sliding down into that thing. And let me tell you, these chairs right here, this is where you can watch the movies. One of my favorite seats on this cruise ship, rain or shine, because it's covered. <laughs> Now, is this a beautiful sight or what? Everybody's up there out cleaning the decks early, but look at this sunrise. It was beautiful this morning. That's why you cruise. All right, look at this deck party with the DJ. These guys are going crazy marching around the whole top deck. Let's go. It looks like we're part of this show here. All right, and this is the pop show, and you get to be part of it. We're like right front center. Love, 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 love. 